Here you go. since we've been out in the shop but uh finally got some time so you can see here we got some new toys my uh my buddy got actually three of them well two and a half there's two of them there there's the other one there um but uh yeah so today what we're going to be doing is mainly just ripping into the uh the the yamaha we're going to be doing a brat kit which i have the kit here in this box and i got new shocks for it in here so that's what we're going to do so this isn't going to be a how-to or anything it's just more of me ripping it apart and you guys ch checking it out Looking at this engine, we're, to do this kit, it's only really back here is what you're working with. Um, but for what we're doing, I feel like I'm going to take this, I want to take the engine out, clean the engine up real nice, clean the frame up real nice, get it all back to being a really, really nice clean bike. So um, it's been sitting for a long time. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to pull the engine out. That's what I'm in the process of doing right now. Um, I'm going to try to, I think I'm going to pull it out that side. I'm not sure yet. So I might be taking this cover off so we can clear some space here. Got the shifter off, got the got the uh, foot peg off on this side as well, clutch, uh, the levers unhooked, the, or the cables unhooked from the lever up here. So uh, so yeah, that's the game plan. We got some motor mounts, we got one here, we got one back here. I'm assuming we got maybe one or two down below. There's probably one right there in the middle, my assumption. Um, and then we got one up on top. So the, the guy originally took, uh, it's actually a family, uh, He's family. So he took the uh, most of the bike apart a couple years ago and it's been sitting ever since. So that's what we're doing. We're going to rip everything out, clean everything up real nice for him, put the kit on there. Um, my brother's going to do the welding and everything because he's really good at it and I'm not. So he's doing that. Uh, so that'll be later on. But yeah, like I said, guys, this is what we're doing today is just ripping into this thing. Hopefully get the engine out, put it on the uh, my bench over here, and then I can go over it and clean it up real, real nice. It's not getting painted. It's just getting cleaned. That's what I want to do.
Hi, kitty. What are you doing up there? What are you doing up there? Just walking around. So all the engine mounts are off. We had one back here, one up here, one up, one up front, one down here, and one right through here, which wasn't, none of them were too bad. Now the engine's just sitting in here. So I should, we should be clear, got all the wiring off. Here's the wire to the starter, the wiring from the stator. We got the speedo here. The clutch is off with the cover. Um, so yeah, so everything should be off. This engine is probably gonna be pretty heavy. So we'll see how it works, but uh, we're gonna pull this thing off and see what happens. Yep, that's it. Stop. Woo! That's a heavy one. She's on my uh, my seat with some wheels. So we're gonna push her over and put her on the bench to clean her up. About an hour and she's out. We're gonna get her all cleaned up. Cat's, cat's loving it. Um, so yeah, so I said it wasn't too bad. But that engine, man, that it's not as heavy. I don't think it's as heavy as my uh, KFX engine. But jeez, oh man, this thing, this thing was a beast. No joke. So uh, game plan for this is just we're gonna clean it up. As you can see, it's just been sitting for a while. It's got some crap on it. So we're just gonna shine it up real nice. Uh, we're actually going to test a couple cleaners out, um, some cheap cleaners. Um, we're going to do another, well, we don't want copyright. Okay. Um, we're, we have uh, Mean Green, and I have that awesome, it's it, like awesome cleaner, I don't know what it's called, from Dollar Store. Uh, but we're going to use both. We're going to test them on this. We're going to, we're going to see if it, if, which one's better. They're both dirt cheap, so it really doesn't matter. But I figured, hey, I bought it. Uh, we'll give it a go. Um, I already got some of the mean green in here. This is the oil or the orange oil. This is the orange, but it actually has the uh, the normal stuff, not the orange in it. Uh, even though it looks orange, which makes no sense to me at all. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, like I said, just a quick little video of that, um, of what to do. It's not even, I didn't even talk. I mean, it's just follow the, follow the way I did it and take the uh, motor mounts out and then uh, put some put something underneath so when you pull the engine out, you put it on top and roll it because that thing is extremely heavy. Uh, but other than that, hope uh, you guys keep following this. We'll keep working on it. Hopefully, we'll get some more things done. There's a lot to do on this bike, actually, more just than the kit, just some maintenance stuff, too. So uh, either way, if you guys enjoyed it, God bless.